going to be really, really cliche and say John Lennon, um, if we could add any musician. I mean, one of the best pop songwriters of all time. And uh, yeah, I would have to say. Although I heard he was an asshole, though. But, yeah, but. yeah. I'd, I'd have to go with, with Lady Gaga. I'd, I'd quite like to see her on stage, actually, with us, with all the crazy costumes and all the sets. Yeah, I could That'd take a fun. break. I could take a break, like every song, because you yeah, can yeah. change in costume. Right? <laughs> That'd be but the dancers kind of do some of the work. <laughs> Well, as you can see, Travis isn't here, so I'm going to answer that for him. Um, he's just kind of got a natural zaniness, a natural wackiness that allows him, uh, from his inner being, uh, to do uh, those epic poses. I don't know if any of you guys have seen him uh, do his uh, interpretive dance uh, on uh, uh, BB, uh, BBC Switch. That was quite epic as well. So I think Travis just has a, a natural ability for these things. <laughs> For me, I've been playing drums since I've been eight. I've been in various bands. I've just always wanted to do it. It's just kind of been natural. Um, yeah. Yeah, I guess same for me. I'm, I mean, I've always been surrounded by music. My dad was a musician, and it's just been natural to play and listen to music all the time. So, yeah, the best, best thing ever. Yeah, um, I'd have to go with uh, Wakestock, this festival we did in Wales a few months ago. Um, we decided to change the set around a bit, and I didn't have a set list on stage. So I, I said, oh no, I don't need it, just a few songs. And I started the wrong song. Twice. Twice. We got it right the third time, but, but I basically just wanted to leave the stage and go home <laughs> for a few minutes. But I pulled myself together and... We, we, we started again and got it right the third time. Yeah, it was quite pathetic, but I, <laughs> yeah. it was funny. Yeah, but you, Speaking of pathetic, yeah. though, while we're on the subject of pathetic, <laughs> um, the most embarrassing thing I ever did, most of you probably are already aware of it because a lot of you were at that show, uh, but the first time we came over to the UK with Simple Plan last November, um, we were in Glasgow in Scotland, and I said we're really enjoying uh, touring England, uh, which obviously was a very big no-no. Um, and uh, yeah, what pulled me through it? Well, I was very, very lucky. Mike, uh, our drummer, happened to be wearing a uh, Scotland football jersey, and that helped uh, reju you know, rejuvenate me a little bit. But uh, it was still quite pathetic, and uh, that was definitely the most yep. embarrassing thing.